Hi guys, welcome back to another little Geek Reviews. So this is the last of the actual six figures that we are going to go through from the Dungeons and Dragons, Honor Amongst Thieves. This time we are going to go through Doric. Now, believe it or not, she came with zero accessories. She, all she came with was this little clip-on feathered type of shoulder cover it's got a little clasp that just clicks on to her arm literally that is it found it strange with that, just that because this one was the most expensive of the actual set as well but flat green like that type of I suppose elf type of look on there she comes with the little horns as well um, I'm just a bit bummed out that she didn't come with additional type of accessories the only other little addition she's got this two little clasp that slides out just bring that in a bit more closer it's like a little clasp, thorny little clasp that comes out from a gauntlet there on a wrist. Literally, that's it. You'll notice here she comes with like a little dragony tail. Now that is just on a ball joint in a little ball peg type of hole. And it's literally slots in. So, and balances in there. So, it's not really fixed in any way at all for just pop that back in again. And there it is. So, you would think, see, see easily just popped straight back out. Is it going to be another hot water job to try and really keep that in there? Who knows? Um, while this is off a shoulder, let's just quickly go through the articulation. So although you've just seen that's on a, like a little ball type of joint, a head does twist and bobble round. Her shoulders are on a ball joint. She's got no bicep twist and her elbows are just on one ball joint. The hands themselves, they are on a little tiny pivot and twist as well. They are on both of them. The waist, it twists from the actual middle joint. So there goes the tail again. Twists at the sides, thighs. Let's have a little look at the knees. So they're on a double uh, pivot there and joints and the actual feet are on a pivot as well with it being the most expensive of them well I say I mean they're not expensive the, it was the most dearest one of the lot although none of them were that dear I think they are very cheaply made if that's what they're giving you bit gutted over there that could have been in another like type of elbow wrist type of joint secured in there she has got the little peg feet as well so let's just clip this back on her arm And let's see so she slides straight onto that peg joint and there she is Doric so let me know your thoughts on the whole figure collection which one is your favorite have you gone further with this collection have you got any of the actual creatures let me know if you have let me know your thoughts on the creatures 
as well because I'm a bit do I go further with this collection especially with them being a bit more costly while you're there dropping those comments do the usual with the like subscribe and tickle that little bell notification so you don't miss out on any others but thanks for checking in on this one and I will see you on the next take care